Hey guys, KT here. Welcome back to some more Metal Gear Solid 4. Last time we fought Liquid, and now we're fi uh, well, we we're still fighting Liquid, but basically we're fighting him in Ocelot form. So yeah, I'm having a lot of difficulty here. I I don't know how many times I've had to redo this. Like I mean, it's really a pain because the, s the controls start getting really slow whenever I'm fighting Ocelot. Like it's weird. Like, whenever I hit melee, sometimes he doesn't want melee. Whenever I hit block, he doesn't want to block. Which is kind of pathetic, to be honest. Because, you know, I'm trying to beat Ocelot, yet it's basically impossible. Like, I mean... If... And that freaking punch that Ocelot does is freaking overpowered. Let me put it like that. I think it needs to be a little less powerful. I'm pretty sure it is in, uh, other freaking in, like, on other difficulties, but, jeez, I can't do it here. Damn, I'm just beating on him. I am not gonna let him get by here. I'm gonna at least lower his health before I do anything, but I made sure to have, like, a little more health than I did before before the fight just uh, so I could like get a little more of a punch a little more than just a few hits and I'm down so you know oh I beat him before he punched me take that Oh, come on! He's still beating me! That's bull! Come on! Oh, yeah. I'm not dealing with this ocelot. Oh, shit! Sweet! Ocelot took over! Hey, ocelot! How you doing? Oh my god, that's an awesome song. At least we're not going against Liquid anymore. We're going against Ocelot. Just pure old Ocelot. That's fucking awesome. I'm, I'm, I'm enjoying this. The song's even good too. Oh god, I'm really enjoying this. Shit. That's badass. Old s It's really switching the songs here. It's not over yet. Oh, punch in the face. Just fall over. Hell yeah! So Liquid's just basically fighting to gain control again, huh? Oh, don't tell me he's gonna try and fucking do this whole fist fighting thing again. Okay, cool. I didn't want to go through that whole health bar thing again. I love the whole throwing a one punch.
Is that it? What's gonna happen? I'm very curious now. So in the end, Ocelot took control. Sonny's program destroyed JD's brain, but left the brain stem intact. She analyzed Naomi's black box and separated the Patriot's control system from the vital lifelines of society. Water, air, electricity, food, medicine, communication, transportation. She cut off the Patriot's control while preserving modern civilization. Maybe it was her way of avenging Olga, her mother. Or maybe she wanted to shape the future into her own ideal image. Or maybe it was just one big defragmentation. Fox alive. The AI is truly living thing. The Patriot's reign has crumbled away. And still, our civilization, a civilization that has thrived on war since the dawn of time, lives on. I wonder if we did the right thing. Naomi. What did we lose? Okay, what's next? Um, now, I do know we're, we're at the end. I'm pretty sure we are. So I'm pretty sure uh, we'll see. Hold on. Yeah, we're going to be heading on to the full-on end, um, which has, like, a lot of detail. Uh, I don't know where it's going to start at, and I don't know where it's going to end, but I'm very curious. 
So this might be a very long video. I don't I don't know. All depends. So let's see. Just got to let that loading go by. I don't know. Epilogue. Okay, so epilogue should be just one full on thing if I'm correct. Colonel. You're going to walk me down the aisle. You're not angry anymore. Oh, I'm still mad. But now, you've got a chance to win me over. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to join these two in holy matrimony. Let us give thanks for the life they will soon share. And pray they have love everlasting. Now, let's all send this new team on their first mission. <laughs> huh? <laughs> hey, huh? go on, do it. I... Oh, oh.
again that brought gifts. A shower of flowers, compliments of Drebin. And a little something extra for me. Okay, now there is one more scene, and I kind of want to show it before I end this, so, yeah. Well, I'm hoping this is a scene. Probably isn't. Nope. Jack, how are you feeling? Do you mind if I sit down? Jack. Don't shut me out. I need you to listen to me. What do you want? You come to laugh at me? Oh, no. Look. Look at the boy. He's yours. I don't have any kids. He's your son. You said 
miscarriage. I lied. I had a healthy baby boy. Roy pretended to be my husband, to protect me and our son. Only until you completed your mission, to shield us from Patriot eyes. What? He didn't even tell Meryl. He sacrificed everything, even his family to protect us. I don't believe it. I'm sorry, Jack. I wanted to tell you. So he's really... John, aren't you going to say hello? You're cool. Kind of like a comic book superhero. Scene from Beauty and the Beast. Don't say that. You're no beast. You're my husband. And his father. And me. I'm going to do my very best. To be the wife and mother this family deserves. <laughs> oh shit. That's awesome. Well, I'm going to end it here. I know it's not fully done, so... I guess this is like the aftermath because I actually just looked up how long the ending is. It's 
It's really long, and I'm not doing a 45-minute video, so we're going to end it in the next part, like, see the full ending. So, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!